it's me, Stacy Nicole, with us in the scraps, and I have some cards to share from my kit with you guys. Um, this kit I pretty much use April through May. I was pretty sick in April, so didn't get a lot of scrapbooking done. Um, so uh, I pretty much use all my stickers in my kit, with the exception of these. And I'll put these in next month's Bastard Stash kit, Inspiration kit, whatever may have you. Um, but I got a lot of cards done, and I'm really happy about that. So I pulled a couple of these stickers here with the cute windows. And I made a couple of uh, Get Well Soon cards with the windows. Really cute. And then it had a leftover like little chair and other stuff there. I cut the boots off of this one. I didn't really want the boots on there. Um, but I went ahead and used a chair in that. I thought that was kind of cute. Um, that is crooked. Get them out. We're just going to leave it crooked, apparently, because it's stuck on there. Anyway, oops, got some foam tape straggling on here. Um, the next stickers that I used are these, um, foily, I don't know what you want to call them, uh, puffy florals. Uh, so pretty, so pretty. And, um, I got to play with some purple paper, which is always fun. I picked this purple paper with pink for this one. It's a thinking of you. And for this one, I used the purple flowers and used the happy birthday. I thought those turned out kind of cute. And then, same thing with these ones. These are, oops. These are some gold foil um, puffy stickers as well. This is what I have left over. And then, I'll put that in my stash. Um, I used um, this wedding paper I had. Um, this wedding paper line. I can't remember who makes it, but had fun with it. I love the red and gold. It's so pretty. And on this one, I used one of my old, um, I want to say, this is from American Crafts or something. Um, it was a piece of paper I find, found at Joann's or something. I used the white and gold one on that. Really pretty. Really pretty. And then the next cards that I made, I used um, this Pink Fresh um, All to New Pack, Celebrate Pack, and this was what was in it. I only have a few pieces left in there, but I made a few cards here. Um, I made this one, it says For You. This is kind of a different one for me. I had a lot of remnants and stuff, so let's try and use them up. I made this Hello one, which was really pretty. This one was really cool with the wreath. And I used, I think this is from Kaiser Craft or something. It says, may your day be as wonderful as you are. Happy birthday. I thought that was kind of cute. Made this one. And I do not remember what that tag is from. It's been forever and a day. I want to see Doodlebug. But I'm not sure on that one. I got that one used up. And use those pretty little... These were in my stash. Um, I want to say it was a fancy pants line or something. But these candles were in my stash along with the happy birthday. And it kind of matched everything. So I went with that. And then I did this one. And I had like a couple of banners here. It says happy birthday to you. Again another Kaiser craft I believe. And then um, this one. This I know is from Recollections. My friend Kathy got me a set of different ones and that that happy birthday one was really pretty do you not ask me where this came from i have no clue i thought it was from this this um ephemera it clearly oh actually i thought it, i didn't think it was i'm like it clearly clearly is not it doesn't really go with the rest of the collection but who am i to say goodness gracious i was like did this come from my stash i couldn't figure out where it came from that's hilarious, but it did come from that collection. And so that was my last card with that. So, um, this is the last one, and I was kind of disappointed, to be quite honest. Because on here, these stickers look beautiful, right? When you put them on a card, do you see it? You can see the foam. Can't see it here. Not very well, anyway. Like, look at this one. Do you see foam? But yeah, it shows up really bad when you're making a card with a color background. But I went ahead and made these anyways. Um, I made this one with the starfish. I am in love with the starfish. 
these little happy birthday ones. They turned out really cute. Even the fact that the foam is on there. That was disappointing, I'll be honest. So, my next kit. Let me grab everything here. My next kit, including these, because I did not get them used. And I do want to use them. They're really pretty. I think they be, make really neat cards. Um, so, my next kit, I went ahead and pulled this. Um, this is from LDRS Creative. It's a lovely watercolor. And it's got gorgeous pieces in here. Not only floral pieces, but tags and everything. And I really like that it has, hello, my friend, get well soon, celebrate, thankful for you. I'm really excited about that. Give me some stuff here. I also pulled these really bright flowers. I was kind of in a more of a bright tone mood. Um, I just needed some brightness, apparently. <laughs> I don't know. But I went ahead and pulled these. Hopefully, they're not like those seashells where you see the foam. The centers of them are a little darker, so I don't think it'll be an issue. But I'm not sure. I went ahead and pulled one of these to make some sentiments with my stamps. So, I pulled one of those. I also pulled these new um, seashell ones I got. I was really excited about those. Can't wait to make some cards with those. And I have these really pretty window ones. Now, to go with the window ones, I pulled these sympathy ones. I thought that um, sympathy ones forever in our hearts or may peace fill your heart. Something to that matter would be really nice on those kind of cards. So, that's my kit for the next month of June. Can't believe it's June already, guys. Goodness, this year is flying by, is it not? All right, guys, those are my cards, and that's my kit. Thanks so much for watching.